Hey, my name is Helen Onik. Welcome to Epic Bursts of Wisdom. Today we're going to be talking about how the internet was made. And one of my main questions was who funds scientists and engineers to invent new technologies? Well, some private equity firms are definitely getting into the game today. But one of the main backers has always been DARPA the Pentagon's Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency. DARPA was originally set up by the Americans who wanted to remain the big dog in the 1950s after the Russian mentally shocked the world with its launch of the Sputnik. Since people wanted to keep their cred in the United States and claim their superiority, Eisenhower hastily established DARPA to keep America competitive. You know who won. <laughs> Over the years, projects like ARPANET and NASA grew so large and complex that they grew into independent Godzillas themselves. Starting in the 1960s, ARPANET was a war-fighting telecommunications network connecting officials to talk about serious business. Did you know your mama was so fat her picture fell off the wall? Whoa. Sorry guys, but did you take my Cheetos? This telecommunication network was actually created because of what we all thought was inevitably coming, which was World War III. Better safe than never, I guess. But in the light of the Soviet Union imploding on itself with an authoritative government, aka communism, the threat of the world going to war again and chaos ensuing de-escalated and officials stopped keeping ARPANET a secret. They thought it was unnecessary and gave its code and technology and blueprints away to the public for free. Talk about raining money. ARPANET would eventually come what we call the internet today. If you want more content like this, be sure to subscribe. Bonus content at dailyrenegade.com. But until next time, folks, my name is Helen, and this is Epic Bursts of Wisdom. <laughs> Hello. Check out this next video on the top 10 secret cases of the United States government.